This video and its accompanying paper present the current findings of an ongoing research project investigating how computer games and related technologies can be used to create virtual worlds with the functionality of typical intelligent environments. For simplicity, we have dubbed these virtual intelligent environments as eye worlds. A dual threaded approach has been employed for this project, with many of the developed tire worlds also being used by other researchers for a variety of investigations including e-learning and end-user programming. Third-party program code can be attached to the eye world system in the same way as with a real intelligent environment. Virtual intelligent devices can be accessed or controlled by a series of UPnP wrappers identical to those used in physical intelligent spaces. Eye worlds with multiple instances of an intelligent space can potentially allow several research groups to work alongside each other simultaneously, each with their own customised environment. The University of Essex iSpace is a bespoke intelligent environment, purpose built as a testbed for pervasive computer science research. The building consists of four rooms, including a lounge, bedroom, study, and bathroom. In addition to the usual furniture and equipment found in a typical household environment, hollow walls and ceilings throughout the eye space have been outfitted with a vast array of sensors, intelligent devices and other embedded technologies. These include a radio tech tracking system, echelon long works controlled lights and havoc units, fidget sensors, and ceiling mounted dimmable spotlights. A number of other devices have also been augmented using X10 appliance modules including lamps and televisions. To enable mixed reality functionality, a virtual intelligence environment was deployed within the eye space. The layout was designed to resemble that of the real building and its contents. Virtual intelligent devices can be identified by the red text above their associated model. This displays the current state and settings of the objects in the environment. If a virtual appliance has been assigned a counterpart in the eye space, its state will match that of the physical device. The virtual world can be used as an interface to remotely control the real devices of the physical intelligence environment. In this example, the state of the real television is changed by the user selecting its counterpart device in the virtual world. Multiple devices can also be controlled simultaneously using this method. Here a virtual light switch is being used to change the state of a collection of ceiling mounted spotlights and X10 enabled lamps. By changing the state of virtual intelligent devices, any modifications are also simultaneously performed on any assigned physical counterparts. This process can also function in reverse with physical intelligent devices changing the state of virtual counterparts by using the same method. In a mixed reality intelligence environment, objects which are completely fictitious, with no presence in the real world, can be included in a virtual component and used to control physical devices. In this example, the persons in the physical eye space are being controlled using a modified version of the virtual switch, which has no presence in the real intelligence environment. By creating a new set of UPnP wrappers for the fictional device, it would appear the same as any other intelligent object on the system network and be controllable by third-party program code. The fictional switch can be augmented even further to allow it to simultaneously modify the states of a range of different intelligent devices. Using this method, fictional virtual devices can also exhibit influence on the attached physical environment. Additionally, through the virtual component, Fictional objects can be represented and used in the same way as any normal intelligent device. In addition to providing a tool for aiding intelligent environments research, the developed tire worlds act as an infrastructure to gather user data and subsequently evaluate a new artificial intelligence mechanism created by this project. The project mechanism is designed to allow computer controlled characters used in video games to each exhibit a unique set of realistic behaviours. Artificial controllers are generated for each avatar by the mechanism using a combination of mimicry and genetic programming. A new eye world model in a small town will be used along with the mixed reality system to further test the artificial behaviour profiles and evaluate their potential usefulness as tools for intelligent environments research.